Welcome back. Today I have got more jailbreak tweaks that compatible with iOS 13. Now for the first one here, it is a tweak for weather. Now if you go to weather, you're gonna see the weather temperature now. It is in Kelvin and you can see we have the letter K here and instead of Celsius, we have Kelvin and you can see we have 289 Kelvin right here. Next one, it is a tweak that let you customize dock. Now you can see I have the classic dock here where I have the background and you can customize in settings. So you can go to setting, then you can go to style and there are a bunch of options that you can change from here. We have standard, we have floating dock and we have classic which is the dock from the older version. But I'm gonna choose floating dock right here so I can select on that. Then I can just um, customize the color as well. So I can change the dark color right here where you can drag like that to go to your custom color that you like. So for example, I'm gonna select this one. And one more thing, you can add the border around the dark. So you can enable borders right here. And then you can just simply respring your device. Now after your phone has been respring, you can see the dark here, it look more beautiful. And one more thing, you're gonna get floating dock, which is, um, it is exactly just like the iPad. So you can just swipe like that, and then you can bring up the docks. Then you can launch the app much faster. For example, I can go to phone. 9 Unlock, it is a tweak that has just been released. And for this one, it is free. What it does, it's gonna remove press home to unlock. So we're gonna get the older features from iOS 9, where you can swipe to unlock and you can see here so i need to confirm with my passcode first now you can see we can unlock our phone by just swipe to the right it bring back the old memory where you can just try to unlock just like that wi-fi list allow you to see the password and the name of the wi-fi and first of all here is the wi-fi that i have been connected to and the information of that wi-fi that i have been connected it also up here so from the first one it does so um, everything about the Wi-Fi that you have connected to and you have the password and you have the name itself so you can check all of the password and the Wi-Fi that you have already connected so it is much more easier it is much more easier to assess find on page by click on share then you can swipe up you're gonna see find on page so you can assess to find on page much faster you can click on that then you can search the word um, on the page here so it's gonna indicate the word that you search move on to music channel which gonna enable TV and movies so you're gonna see the new button right here so your TV and your movie that you have just added it's gonna show up here and you're gonna see the two options on the top so we have um, TV and we have movies right here in your music apps I think this is the tweak that you should have on your device which gonna give you the notification when someone trying to tracking you and this is the only sample of it so it's gonna give you the notification quick search it is basically allow you to search the tweak in settings so in order to get Twix search to work make sure you have preference organizer to install on your device and this is the tweak that you need you need preference organizer too and then you should be able to install Twix search and for Twix search you can just search the tweak on the top here for those of you that have too many tweaks and you want to go to the tweak much faster so you can install it you can search by the name and it is much more convenient lastly we have typing notifications and what it does it's gonna give you the message while someone is typing to you especially on message and I think it does work with iMessage so if someone typing to you you're gonna see the notification that they are typing so you gonna notice much more easier finally thank for watching I hope you like all of these tweaks and one more thing if you want to get the themes you can check in my video description I always include the themes and the wallpaper that I have used in my video you can check them out